This is Terry with Etch Glass Doors Florida. I wanted to talk today about the differences between um, etching. You've heard the terms uh, single stage etching and shading. This is single stage etching. And with single stage etching, there's what you call reverse etching and the positive etch. Well, what you can see here is that we've got a template with a logo on it on just clear glass. So this, this white area is still the template. So I just wanted to show you the actual difference when you see the template off. And if we start right here and pull it, actually, I think I can pull it this way. You can see it's starting to come off here. That's glue. So this is called single stage etching, single stage etching, just like I said. Um, this is not the normal thing you would do for something decorative for in somebody's home. You would do um, shading on um, the template. Okay, so we've got this um, template. We still got to take off the background of the template. And this is your logo in what we call single stage etching, okay? So unless this person wanted something that was kind of, um, you know, fancier, wasn't logo-ish, um, you wouldn't use the shaded etching. Just things like leaves and flowers and animals, they all look better shaded. So here you go, single stage etching, positive etch, and this is called a reverse or a negative edge. So the background is edged and not the letters or the design itself is etched. So there you have it. Thank you. Visit our website, etchedglassdoorsfl.com. Thank you. This is Terry again with Etch Glass Doors, FL.com. I just wanted to show you that this is the shaded version. So you can see that we have clear areas. That's the background, but it could have been on um, textured glass and there would be no clear areas. But this person, this is what they wanted. This is what they chose. So this is shaded. Okay, just came out of the sandblast booth, so it's a little dirty. You know, the frame's dirty. Um, you can see the the etching can't quite touch the full etching or else you'll the design will just disappear so it's a it's a process of heavy to light shading and you have to have a lot of control to be able to do that this is a bigger design so it's a little easier but as you get smaller and smaller in your designs they get harder and harder so you 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 only got one shot at it and it's really easy to mess up so you just have to be careful thank you